Garrett Rose, just what you've been able to take away from the last couple days? So my pace is just... I, um, just hitting the open guy, finding the open teammate, just reading the defense. I think I've, I've been doing a, a better job of that. Uh, teams have been throwing different things at me, coming off the ball screen and different sets, and I think I'm doing a good job adjusting and still getting the ball moving on offense. What was the biggest difference between day one, day two for you? Uh, just the aggressiveness of them showing out on the ball screen or or the uh, commitment they were showing. You know, they, they stayed with me to the ball was out of my hands, and they really made solid defensive plays and stayed solid so I, I didn't I couldn't like thread the needle or anything so I just had to make simple reads and you know uh, credit to myself I just tried to be patient and deal with it the best way I can. What does it mean to you to have a long time vet like Vince Carter out here supporting you guys? It means a lot because he doesn't have to be here and he could he could be somewhere else and he's here with us and helping me a lot helping the other guys and just giving his knowledge spreading it to us. And then lastly, from everything that you've been through in your career, adversity, everything at Louisville, just what you can say and how you've grown as a player. Well, I, um, it's always taken me a year and a half to, to get it and to, to break out. It's been like that in high school. My junior senior year, I broke out, led New York in scoring. And college, it took a year and a half. And then after that, I was a two-time All-American. And I'm a big believer in history repeating itself. So not saying I'll be anything great or Hall of Fame. I'm just saying it'll take me. I'm, it's, the time is coming, and I got to start getting it. And I, and I feel like I'm starting to understand the game at this level so I can finally have an impact and help a team become something they want to be. Thanks,